not certain I would wearing be here a today. heed bottle on the night my helicopter experienced a material failure and crashed Without your product this letter never would have been written key three the original helicopter emergency egress device third generation is the military and civilian aviation model of the spare air scuba backup system produced by submersible systems the spare air is the invention of Larry Williamson, an avid scuba diver who almost died in a dive accident where his air supply failed while at depth. Seeing the need for a simple and unobtrusive breathing system with a separate redundant air supply, Larry created the spare air. The first spare air was distributed in 1979 and since then over a quarter of a million models have been sold worldwide. After more than three decades, the Spare Air evolved into the current next generation design. The Spare Air provides an independent air supply for scuba divers at depths up to 130 feet or 40 meters. The Spare Air is the choice of extreme sportsmen like tow-in surfers and kayakers offering hands-free operation. The Spare Air Industrial is ideal for escaping short-term toxic air emergencies. 50 to 80 percent of all fire deaths are attributed to smoke inhalation. The Spare Air Escape, packaged with a mask, provides a few extra moments of life-saving air. After Spare Air was made popular by scuba divers, the Helicopter Emergency Egress Device, or HEED, was developed at the request of the U.S. Navy to increase survivability of military and commercial personnel in short-term out-of-air emergencies. The HE-3 is a compact, lightweight, and reliable self-contained breathing apparatus. HEED units have been sold to the U.S. Navy, Air Force, Marines, Army, Coast Guard, the Secret Service, U.S. Customs, and many other national and local government agencies. International governments from Australia, Canada, England, Germany, Italy, Japan, Korea, Poland, Spain, Turkey, and many others have utilized the HEED for their national agencies. Private companies including Bell Helicopter, British Petroleum, Sikorsky Aircraft, Aramco, Pfizer, Sony Magnetic Products, Walt Disney World, Universal Studios, and SeaWorld, to name a few, have recognized the advantage of using HEED-3 or spare air in their operations. Applications include the use in rotary winged aircraft, fixed winged aircraft, and vehicles that may be subjected to water egress or toxic air emergencies. There are several advantages to the HEED-3. The simple compact design of HEED-3 is less complicated to both use and repair than competing models. The HEAT-3 is always on, ready to deliver life-saving air when you need it. The HEAT-3 can cost several hundred dollars less than competitors' models. The HEAT-3 is off the shelf and ready for immediate delivery. The unit is simple to maintain, requiring a basic inspection once a year and full service every five years. Units can be serviced by a trained qualified technician or by submersible systems directly. The HEAT-3 is manufactured in two sizes, a 1.7 cubic foot model ideal for mounting on personal vests and in extremely confined spaces, and the 3.0 cubic foot model ideal for vehicles and buildings. Both sizes are equipped with a holster designed to fit typical MOLLE systems. HEAT-3 is a complete emergency breathing system in an always-on, all-in-one unit. The HEAT-3 is comprised of a balanced, single-stage, on-demand regulator attached to a high-pressure aluminum cylinder. The refill port or check valve is used to fill the unit. The pressure indicator provides a PSI measurement of the pressure within the air cylinder. The cylinder is manufactured by submersible systems using an extruded aluminum plug, necked and machined at our Huntington Beach facility. Our cylinders have passed the rigorous requirements demanded by the United States and European Union, including ballistics testing. Each cylinder is marked with the appropriate North American or European tank markings, depending upon which market the unit will be sold. He 3 is CE approved. The regulator body and many of the parts are machined at our Huntington Beach facility. 
Each unit is produced to our exacting standards using modern machines and computers. Submersible Systems is ISO certified. It is simple to determine the operational status on a HE-3. On a dial gauge pressure indicator, the needle must be within the green zone. Inspect the unit for obvious physical damage and broken or loose parts. With proper care and maintenance, the HE-3 can last for years and be refilled and reused many times. The unit can be refilled at most local dive shops. By using a personal high-pressure breathing air quality compressor available from submersible systems. By attaching to a fully pressurized 3000 PSI scuba tank. Or in extreme circumstances, by using a high-pressure hand pump. The HE-3 package includes a MOLLE system holster that utilizes two straps that secure with snaps to allow quick and easy installation inside a vehicle or helicopter, or to a person wearing a flight vest. The 1.7 cubic foot model requires 6 inches of pull clearance, and the 3.0 cubic foot model requires 9 inches of pull clearance to easily access the unit. The always-on design is ready to deliver air instantly. To operate, pull the D-ring on the holster to expose the HEED-3. Grab the HEED-3 regulator head and remove from the holster. This action will remove the mouthpiece cover. Place the HEED-3 mouthpiece into the user's mouth. If you are underwater or exposed to toxic air, briefly press the purge button on top of the unit or exhale sharply to expel any water or toxic air from the regulator before taking a breath. Continue to inhale and exhale while safely ascending or regressing. The HE-3 balanced regulator will provide air in any orientation, including while upside down or sideways. After use, simply refill the unit and redeploy. If the unit has been drained completely of air, especially during an underwater emergency, the unit will require a complete overhaul to remove corrosive water from the system. If a unit does not hold air, and at least once a year, a leak test should be performed on the HE-3 unit and referred for service if necessary. Every five years, the regulator should be serviced with a complete overhaul kit to lubricate key parts and replace degraded O-rings, rubber washers, plastic parts, and the burst disc. A requirement of high-pressure cylinders in U.S. markets, the cylinder should be hydro-tested every five years. If the cylinder shows signs of pitting or damage, it must be replaced. Store heat 3 in a clean, dry environment. In humid conditions, store units with some pressure inside the cylinder to keep moisture from entering the system. Submersible Systems is proud to offer an effective and practical helicopter emergency egress device that has made a profound difference in the lives of so many people. To read testimonials and for more information about the HE-3, visit HE-3.com or contact us directly.